Welcome back to Jack's Tech Corner. I'm your host, Jack, as many of you know that, and I have some exciting news to tell you about. This short video is going to be a little bit more informational than what it will be as a tutorial type, but it's very important information that I feel you need to have because there's something exciting that I'm actually launching. It will be actually tomorrow. I hate dating these videos. Uh, it will be launching on uh, Sunday, April the 3rd, 2011. So that would be tomorrow from this video. And what we are launching is, as you can see on your screen right here, a live webcast. Now I've been wanting to do one of these for quite some time, and I haven't been able to get the word out. Nobody ever came by to check it out. But I want to do a live webcast, and I want to be able to have folks call in, such as you, to be able to call in uh, and ask me questions about Photoshop Elements or Windows, or even your Mac, uh, if you have questions or maybe even basic networking questions and we can go over that stuff and maybe learn together as we get more people viewing and tuning in um, I want that to happen that's going to be going off tomorrow which would be Sunday and every Sunday following that if it works out for us it's gonna be 10 a.m. on Sundays and you know we'll, we'll just play it by ear and see how long it's going to run I figure uh, at least an hour but uh, maybe uh, maybe it could run into two hours, so we'll see how that works. What I'm thinking of doing after uh, this show, I'm going to you know start with some like Photoshop tips and tricks, I guess, on Sundays or maybe whatever else we can wrap up. Some future other show possibilities I was thinking about will be Windows Server Weekly for all you Windows Server fans out there, and I know I've gotten uh, quite a few of you from my YouTube videos. E-Reader Night, uh, if you have a Nook or a Kindle or a Kaboo uh, or any one of those e-readers, I'd like to hear from you. We can talk about e-readers, talk about what books you're finding and where you might be finding your e-books at. iPad Weekly, for you iPad folks out there, maybe you're not sure of how to use your iPad or maybe you're not getting the most out of it. So we want to talk about iPad Weekly. We also want maybe a network chat night. Maybe we're going to do some network chat. Uh, about you know what's in your network or maybe you uh, can ask me for some assistance and I'll be uh, glad to share anything I have for you about networking and how to maybe help you with your networks and keep that more uh, in tune and in line with everything to uh, give you more of a, uh, a training or a tutorial type view there. Next a lot of you have been emailing me asking me about Photoshop Elements 9 tutorials or DVDs. Well I'm going to try to hold this up here and get a good view of it right here it is Photoshop Elements 9 and this is volume 1 it is now ready and it is on the website so it's Photoshop Elements 9 volume 1 it's ready and it's $18 and $2 shipping and it's ready to go on the website now you may be saying Jack how do I find your Justin TV channel what is Justin TV not a lot of people even know and to be honest with you, I probably knew more about Ustream a few weeks ago and I played around with it and it kept cutting out and I kept having intermittent troubles with Ustream. So I decided to move my show onto Justin.tv. So what is Justin TV? It's just basically a place where you can come and watch media. That's what it's for. Um, and it's for live broadcasting. And as I broadcast these shows, it will also record it and post it on there. So I have one from last Sunday where I played around a little bit. Uh, it looks like it has about 22 views. Uh, you can see it right down here, um, right down towards the bottom there. And all you have to do <clears throat> is go to the website, justin.tv slash Jack's Tech Corner. Or I made it even easier for you. You can actually go to jackstechcorner.com and you can, there's a little player over here on the right hand side now. So you can actually bring that up and check that player out. And I also went one step further and I created a basic web page for it. If you go to live, why is my cap box on? Live.jackstechcorner.com, you can actually bring the player up and have the live stream right there. You can full screen it and hey, we'll be good to go. I did go ahead and purchase a phone number from Skype. So you can call in with your cell phones. Uh, you don't have to have Skype anymore to get a hold of us. If you call in with your cell phones or with your home phone, uh, the number is right here. It's 724-701-0911. Uh, and at the present time, 
That's only going to be answered on Sundays during the show. Just uh, makes a, makes my life a little easier. So hold your questions until Sunday during the show, and by all means, call in. You can also Skype me. Just search and Skype under contacts. Do a search for Jack's Tech Corner. You'll find me and add me to your contact list. Now what I thought I would do is go ahead and take just a couple seconds of your time and I'm going to just show you how I set up the new studio to do this live stream. So let's go ahead and flip the camera over and we're going to flip into our uh, secondary camera. And now what you're viewing is actually you're actually viewing this camera over here on the side of me and you're viewing uh, a, a MXL 990 microphone with a new, uh, basically a new pop screen, a pop filter, or a windscreen on there to uh, protect it from any popping or pee sounds. Uh, the main reason I bought it is I watched a couple reviews, and I bought this uh, screen because it keeps moisture from out of the microphone. I don't want uh, moisture to be in that microphone, so that's why I basically purchased it. Next, you can see here we have the iMac. Uh, the iMac 27 inches, the grand central uh, scheme of things here. That's where all of my uh, trainings and tutorials are built. And um, when I push these out onto the Justin.tv, that's where those screens will be coming from whenever we do screenshots. And then over here on the other side, right over here, we have a 23 inch Acer monitor. And like many folks, I pull up on a little boxer just to kind of make it even and bring it around. But if you can see over here, this is a program that I'm using called Cam Twist, and Cam Twist allows me to uh, switch monitors. You know, I mean, switch cameras around. It allows me to do live desktop shots. If you, I don't know if you can see that come up there. Um, here, I'll, th I'll cross these off into it. There's a live desktop shot uh, that you're seeing of the desktop itself. Pretty cool. I'll uh, bring back up my uh, eyesight camera. And then I can crossfade right back into this camera and be right back with you. So the live stream is set up, um, and uh, Justin.tv looks like it's going to be a really good platform for us to go ahead and broadcast on. My quality is probably not as good as some you see on there. I mean, it's going to be decent. You can watch it, and you'll be able to see what's going on. But the quality is a little lower because I don't have the upstream or the uploading bandwidth of, of, that some of these people have that are doing these shows. But it'll be very, uh, it should be very uh, legible. You should be able to read everything. Sometimes the screen uh, shots and the screen tutorials, I'll explain as I go and hope you get enough out of it so you'll get the idea of what's going on. So that's about it. I'm sorry I blabbered on with this one. It's just basically telling you about the new live stream on Sundays. I really hope you can join us. I hope it's a decent time. Hey, uh, if you can't get here right at, right at 10 o'clock or 10.30, just click on that link and tune in anytime. Uh, you can also follow me on Twitter. I'll be posting it on Twitter when it goes live. Um, or go to Justin TV. What I've learned with Justin TV is if you follow, sign up for your free account and follow me. And as soon as my stream goes live, you get an email. So it's pretty, pretty cool how that works. Okay, well, thank you very much uh, for all your continued support for uh, Jack's Tech Corner. And allowing me to come into your house or coming to your uh, DVD drives there and help you along with your learning of Photoshop elements. And please invite me in and we can learn even more about the computer, networks, Windows servers, and the Mac itself. So until next time, I'll see you back here very soon and I'll see you tomorrow for that live stream at justin.tv slash Jack's Tech Corner. See you then.